We added a new thing to the chicken barn. As you guys have seen in probably quite a few videos, that it's been really hot in here, like 113 degrees. So we got a Hessier, Hessier cooling Hes Hes swamp. So I don't know how to say it. swamp cooler, and it's it's got pretty cold air. You can see the chickens are er, earlier they were really close to it, but they like it. They like it a lot. And we have a a thermometer. And also on the other side of this notebook, we are writing down some things to experiment with it and see what works the best. And the best way to do it is to have that fan on full blast. The wind's kind of blowing it. I unplugged it so you can hear me better. And that fan right there is still going. It's an exhaust fan, so it's taking out some air. Not nearly as much as this one's bringing in air, and this one's pushing air that's real cold. The way that the swamp cooler works is it takes water continuously through there and it fills up the tank. I mean, you can do it not continuously if you don't want to. And then it uses uh, like cardboard, or I don't think this is cardboard. Uh, I guess it's some, it's some kind of heavy media cardboard stuff. And it drains water onto it and it pump, pumps it up and it lets the water leak down it and it blows it out through the fan and it really cools down the barn good. We can show you guys inside here. Yeah, that's, that's our water tank and you can see that the, the uh, filter is dripping the water back down and then you can in there further there's also the pump that pumps it up and you've got a fan that's blown it out it's got pretty good it's got this little adjustment I can't give you my opinion on this swamp cooler yet I I can't recommend it yet because we've only had it for like a day now but I, it seems to be great for this because it's super low humidity in here the humidity is like 20% in here all the time no, I mean around 30% all the time, but we're in Idaho, it's a desert, humidity is relatively low all the time. I mean, if you're in a more, if you're in a place that isn't as, uh, a place like on the east coast somewhere where it's really humid, this is going to suck. It's not going to do anything. But if you're in places that are dry, west, you know, Arizona, California, Utah, Idaho, that there's way more places than what I just listed, but that's where... It would work the best, and I think it works great for these conditions. Subscribe.